<laughs> right, do, do you guys mind right terribly if I don't use these? No, 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 I, no. They bother me so much. But yeah, just tell me it. if I need to, you know. You, you no just a quick sound check. Ago, Does everybody but... sound good? Yeah, check, I, check. I think, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we sound good. We sound a little hot. Tim, good but... to see you, pal. Hey, you man. Know. Nice to meet you, dude. Sorry yeah, about yeah, I'm yeah. really sorry, everybody. <laughs> I'm really sorry. Tim, hit the intro. Let's fucking do this, dude. All right, everybody. Hey, welcome back to the Untitled Podcast. It's me and me and Joe's Untitled Podcast, everybody. Uh I am here. Uh, this, this, this is it. Look, I'm frantic. <laughs> <laughs> My co-host is right here. He's pretty pissed. And we're starting about 49 minutes late, exactly. And I feel pretty bad about that. Mm -hmm. uh, so, so look, yeah, I'm in the hot seat right now. Uh, but we're starting up the podcast very good. Joe, take it away. Let me uh, let me breathe. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you take it easy there. Smoke that joint that you totally didn't roll on your way here. Um, and, uh, yeah, so are you guys ready to watch me pretend not to be furious? Here we go. Hell yeah. I'm just kidding, by the way, Timmy. I love you. Um, anyways, uh, I'm, li I'm living in a world of absolute fear, by the way. <laughs> I, shaking, I don't dude. know if Joe is the type to yell. <laughs> I, I, yeah. I'm not sure yet. You know what this feels like? It feels like, uh, a, like a pretty new couple invited me over for game night. I was the only one who showed up and they're mm -hmm. fighting. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> that's, that's you know, they, it's yeah, that yeah. energy where it's, <laughs> it's like the passive aggressive yeah. quips and the, but Joe's smiling, but it's not fooling anyone. It's, it's a, yeah, it's, it's a, not fooling anybody. <laughs> yeah. It's not going to show, it's not going to play on camera. <laughs> Enjoy that energy. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, so welcome. Our, our guest, is uh, Spencer Ka Cavins or Cavins? Cavins. Cavins. Yeah. Uh, very funny comic around uh, Austin right here. Um, and we're just going to get right into it. Timmy, first question. You know what to do. All right. When did you learn how to start masturbating? When did I learn how yeah. to start? When did you start doing it? When did you, like, you, did you maybe start doing it by accident when you didn't know you were pleasuring yourself, like by sitting yeah. on a massage chair or something like that? Not a massage chair. You know what I would do? I would, uh, I would lay down. We had these really, like, really soft blankets, and there was a space in between my bed and the wall. And I would say, if you ask my mom, I don't think there was ever a time I wasn't masturbating. Okay. She said, as a baby, I would sit there and like just rock. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've always been a fuck machine. <laughs> and, uh, and but I would lay down a soft blanket in between the the uh, the bed in the wall and I would just lay there and just rock back and forth. And I did yeah, that. Just get a good motion going. Great yeah. motion going. And I did that like truly as far back as, as I can remember. And my, my mom would play this song in the car sometimes when she would pick me up. And it was like a little kid song, but it was about the animals in a farm <laughs> pairing off. And I remember not knowing what the feeling was. Somehow I equated the mating to sex. Like I knew that them pairing off you know, yeah. was something very sexy. Yeah, it These was something they needed to be alone for. Yeah. yeah, totally. And I would look forward to the. I remember Sunny drives home. <laughs> And looking forward to getting home so I could throw down that blanket and just fuck the shit out of it. That's so that's so interesting for like a mother to be like to know at like such a young age, like my son's gonna crush yeah. pussy. And, yeah, and <laughs> yeah. to support yeah, yeah, it yeah. in a way that you give him a little theme song. For like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Here's the cow song. And then, All right. yeah, when did it get good. sexual though? When did uh, you learn like it was time to do this? Like, with, like uh, thinking about girls from school or something? Yeah. Um, Again, pretty early, but I, I remember, so fourth grade, I was still doing the same motion. So yes. I was still lay down the soft blanket. And you're blanket. talking about like, you're just s swimming on a on a blanket. You're yeah, just... I would lay, I mean, I would, I would with intention, yeah. I would rock back and forth with intention and, uh, and I would have a boner. I would get a okay, boner. Side note, are you a good fucker right now then? Because you've been I think practicing I'm good. I do think I'm good at sex. Yeah. Yeah. I do think like, I'm good at sex. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. But, but that motion doesn't really help you. You can't yeah, go well, side, side to side. side. Yeah, of course. But I mean, it was a hip, it's been a hip workout since you were yes. an adolescent, yes. is what I'm My saying. My psoas yeah. is open. But girls' pussy, they're, they're, <laughs> see, they're hot dog style, not hamburger style. Yeah. If they were hamburger style, oh, I'd be insane. Yeah. Man, you wouldn't but be here right now. You should go fucking Asian girl. I know. By the way, that's a lie. My girlfriend's Asian. It's a complete lie. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, I was trying to think of. Uh -huh. I was trying to. I was hoping you would say another thing that would set up the joke. What? Uh, I was hoping you just say it's the other way. It's the other. Look, man, I just. It's all right, man. Breathe. You're, you're good. ruining you're good. everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. So, um, uh, what? Well, sorry. Real, I, I yeah. want. I want to answer this because it's always fascinating me. There's a time where you orgasm, but you can't ejaculate yet. Uh -huh. You yes. remember that? Yep. Yes. So he that doesn't. happened on the blanket, and I was thinking about Hermione Granger. For real. It, but but this is before the movies. Just from the books, I was reading no the shit. book, and I thought about her using a spell that would make me come. Whoa. A lot. Really? And I remember thinking about that and I was rocking back and forth and the the climax wasn't even necessarily good. It was like uh like a full body yes. like electric yeah, chair. Yeah, it's everything. Yeah, yeah no, it was it, too did sensitive. your dick do like maybe like yeah, this oh, a little I, bit I spazzed out. Yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah. And it yeah. was like sensitive to the touch. Yep. Yeah. See? 
Whoa. This is a like-minded yeah. guy. Yeah, yeah. Our best yeah. boners are wasted at eight. In oh, I know. Yeah. yeah. The hardest I've ever been was on like a middle school bus in the morning. Oh, for sure. You Yesterday. Know? Oh, for sure. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so much so that when I get off the bus, I'd have to pretend to like go through my backpack and hold it in front of yeah. my hunch oh, over a little bit for like yeah. half the day. They're like, "What are you looking for yeah. in your bag?" I'm like, "I can't find it." Um, so when did you like start like uh, what was like early porn for you? Age, give it to me, by the way. Uh, age, current You're, age. How old are you? Yeah, 33. 33? Yeah, okay. Okay. 33. Right. Um, it would for sure be. I had an older brother, so I got introduced to a lot of cool shit early. Yes. Yeah. Right? That's always yep. how it goes. So uh, it was definitely dial-up internet, photos loading from the top down, mm -hmm. that sort of thing. But also, he put me on to, to chat rooms really early. Oh, okay. Yeah. And so we would do, I would go on those early internet chat rooms. This is like in the 90s, right? We just talked and to pedophiles, man. Yeah, here's yeah. what's funny, though. I would. I'm sure I was talking to pedophiles, too, but also, but too. I was lying about my age, too. So I would mm -hmm. say, they would yeah. say ASL, a age, yeah, sex, age, location. Yeah, yeah. And I would always do like, like 18 female. Yeah, yeah. Phoenix, Arizona. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Florida, I don't, yeah. totally. And so then I would just be lying, saying that I'm a girl. I don't know why. Mm -hmm. I was yeah, saying yeah. I'm a, as a woman because I'm just gonna get a picture of a penis sent back to me. Yeah, yeah. And then they'd be like, "Oh, can you send a pic?" And then I'd Google like like sexy boobs, yeah. sexy nice, bobs, dude. and yeah, and yeah, then yeah. send that. Nice. And so yeah, yeah. Okay, so that was early. <clears throat> and so you were through dial up. Did you ever jerk off to like uh, like um, like Cinemax movies or softcore porn? When did video porn get into your life? Did you wait uh, till just internet kept speeding up? It was up? internet. You it was just internet, just for all, sure. Yeah. You were just definitely. patient with the internet. Yeah. You're like, this is going to be the way, and I'm not changing. You yeah, know? I don't think, I we never, I never had that, like, that hidden DVD. Yeah. I, I found mm -hmm. my dad had a copy of Sorority Sex Kittens, too. But I didn't, but I was I was well into masturbating by the time yeah. I found that. Like yeah, the internet, yeah. I watched that and I was yeah, like, I can't that. even scrub to the part I want. Yeah. You know. Yeah, yeah. Also, that's such a like a like if you're already ahead, like an in internet porn finding that it's like, oh, dads are so lame. Dude, yeah, you know yeah I mean? totally. I, yeah, yeah. Tell you, I went through a week of porn DVD phase. You know, yeah. when I first moved to San Diego, I didn't have internet in the place yet. You look like you sell them. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> you I, know. <laughs> Yeah, I look like I sell them to myself. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I look, it's just I look you. like I walk in there. I, <laughs> Running to different sides yeah. of the counter. Someone yeah. goes to pick one, you're like, not that one. Not that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, not that yeah. one. I'm saving that one for me. That's yeah. mine, uh, no. <laughs> how much for the fake ass? Yeah. <laughs> but they're like four or five hours long on porn That's DVDs. Crazy. It's yeah. insane, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, so let's see. Okay, so you're, you're masturbating, you're watching porn, you're watching dial-up porn. When do you start like kind of getting interested in like girls? I was always really, I always had lots of crushes, mm -hmm. and I had, uh, when I was in kindergarten, I would sneak off under the tables and, and kiss with uh, Leah Margaret. Okay. And then uh, uh, somebody who's still like a family friend, her name was uh, uh, Sarah. Mm -hmm. We, uh, we I was over at her house, I was, must have been kindergarten, yeah, kindergarten age, and in front of her, you know those little plastic kitchen sets? Mm -hmm. She had one of those in her room, and we <clears> used that <throat> as the altar, and she married us. Wow. Like she did the whole ceremony. Yeah. Um, it's funny because I remember at the time being like, wow, you're like really well spoken. How do you know all this? I'm sure now it was just like, and do you and do you like her? Yeah. Yeah, and she, yeah, because yeah. she likes you. But at the time I thought it was like really ceremony. I was like, whoa, this is like official. So you weren't shy with like like female energy at all. Like no, I wasn't shy. And then we went and consummated the marriage. We went yeah, under her that was bed. My next yes, question. totally. I was gonna say, is like, did you do it? Did you play adult everything? Yes, she kissed my she she kissed my penis, and then she showed me her pussy. Uh -huh. And uh, keep in mind, this is kindergarten, and sure. I was afraid to put my I was afraid to lick it, and so I remember <laughs> I I kissed my finger and I just touched it. <laughs> That's. And that was how we had sex. <laughs> that's and, she, really, and, she got, and she got pregnant. That's really yeah, similar well, yeah, to how course, I lost yeah, my yeah. virginity, actually. What? Did, wait, I don't think I know this. No, that's, that, that was kidding. That's not how I lost uh, <laughs> <laughs> When I was a small child, my brother's friend had a little sister who was just a couple years older than me. And so yeah. I hung out with her a lot. And she had us doing a fake wedding thing. And then she wrote, she taught me what sex was. But we weren't yeah. doing real. She showed me her little fake, not little fake, a little child vagina yeah. and stuff like that. She looked at my little boy penis. This whole yeah. thing. Am it, I the only one in this room who's never seen a child's pussy? Yeah, I've never either. Nice. All right. Well, I didn't believe that out of Andrew. <laughs> yeah. Andrew that was a beat late. <laughs> no, no, that was right on point. I knew I knew Joe was going to ask. Well, it's but, interesting because those memories are forever. You know what they're I mean? They're not. Because here's the thing is, I remember some weird amorphous shape like that was not a pussy. My memory of what this woman showed me in her pants was almost more like a dick. Huh. That's very okay. Freudian. Yes. Whoa. I don't know why. Yeah. 
When when you see ink blots, do you also just see a big fat I just fat see cock? dicks all the time. Don't, wait, don't you guys? Isn't there that a dick on that wall? That <laughs> just around my dicks everywhere. <laughs> it's just two dicks sitting across. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Aren't we all cartoon dicks right now? <laughs> 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 yeah, that, that sounds like a pedophile thing. Everything just looks like boys' penises. Yeah. Your honor, just, yeah. Tim was yeah. late because he's like the freeway was just jam packed with dicks <laughs> nonstop. No, the dicks weren't moving. He's driving a giant yeah. dick. <laughs> nice. All right. So when's like first uh, girlfriend like relationship stuff? Like uh, not kindergarten stuff, but like you know, obviously like um, yeah, like real actual relationship. I mean, I had like stuff. crushes and stuff like that, and like little kisses and stuff through, mm-hmm. through junior high. But uh, it was a, a Japanese gal, okay. Sarah Nakamura. And I loved Sarah. Did you lose your virginity to her? Yeah, yeah. You Straight did. up and down okay. pussy. Straight up and down pussy. Okay. I'm telling you, dude. I'm yeah. Telling you. yeah. It was just up, down, tentacles to the left and right. And that's <laughs> yeah, it. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So she was the first one. Yes. What what happened? Uh, what happened in the relationship? No, or? like nah, you lost your virginity. virginity. Okay, yeah, yeah. all right. Uh, I told you this was a little bit uh, mm-hmm. uh, cringe. I I really had an idea of which I think a lot of us do. It's like you want to be an adult. It's almost like the the like. Wanting to, do you want that water? Do you want that water? It's the ash in God damn. Oh, oh yeah, I'm, I'm not okay. gonna, I'm not gonna finish <laughs> drinking it. So if you want to ash, go ahead. All right, All right go ahead. Uh, so we we had it planned. She she was not a virgin. She oh, had had sex at like twelve, thirteen. Shit. Yeah. Oh. So okay. she would, and what we had been doing for for months. She, but she didn't want to be a she didn't want to be a, a whore. She really regretted that she had lost her virginity. Like okay. she wanted it to be a first time. Sometimes she would actually cry because she's like, I want you so badly to be my first. Oh jeez. And I like hate that I've like already done this yeah it's because her first was her uncle and, and I, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, 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 <laughs> no it was a guy who would later uh, go to prison for stabbing a dude for coke um that's nice so, that's so yeah, cool. yeah that's, that's fucking cool, cool. i bet his dick dude. was massive dude Damn. i'll i'll <laughs> tell you about how he came up again in my life this guy was like unshakable <laughs> he was unshakable uh his name was josh desmond mm-hmm. and now he's like a full-on gangster's disciple wow. padded face like i'm sure he's back in prison yeah. like the long braids like join like a seattle like native american gang okay yeah, yeah. like yeah, like something. he's got like tomahawks tattooed on. honestly he looks sick as fuck yeah, yeah it's yeah. a certain type of gangster you don't really see <laughs> yeah. which is like an indigenous fucking gangster's yeah. disciple it's so sick yeah just coming honestly. at you with a hatchet yeah, yeah. yeah. totally and he's, yeah, he's got yeah. all the tats and he's got long braids and his oh, name's man. probably like fucking Two Guns or something. Yeah. I was gonna say, what's his like Native American name? Yeah, you know? yeah I don't know. It's cool. it's so it's like, awesome. It but... Shoots gun sideways. Yeah, like... yeah. <laughs> it's so sick. Uh, but yeah, so so she so she uh, she really wanted us to to wait. So we would do like everything, but and we would even play like just the tip. Just and the I'd, tip. I'd put. Oh my god, that's it, losing your virginity. It, it was that's so losing, that has to count. That's yeah. losing your virginity Dude, for a guy. You fucked her. It was you... so good. <laughs> it was so good. We were like fourteen, and it and it just felt crazy. I'd be like, please, like, no, like we. No. Did you lose it with a condom? On? I lost it with a condom. On. So here's okay. what happened. So we planned the date. I remember I was I was uh, we were dry humping, and I'm probably spraying all over my fucking <laughs> yeah. pants. And she goes. Ready. Dude, dry humping was the move for me, especially you though, because you're a motion dude. Yeah, you were always mm, fucking rubbing, buddy. I still do it. I can't <laughs> yeah. like make out with my girlfriend without, without dry, humping. Like, dry I dry, humping. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I, that's how I initiate sex almost. Same, pretty much always <laughs> in cuddling. I start a motion. Yeah, I start a bit of a motion. You know yeah. what she'll say? Because you put like your your leg in between their legs. She'll be like, "Oh, he's giving me thigh." Mm. <laughs> he's he's like, giving me you're, thigh. Yeah, you're slipping in the thigh to, to yeah. turn into something more than just a friendly kiss. Uh, so anyway, so she told me she was ready. So we had it planned. So my dad had a. Uh, I'm okay. Thank you though. My dad had a, a condo, him, him and my mom had just divorced, and he was never home. He was usually out on business. And so we're going to do a sleepover there, mm-hmm. and we're going to have sex. Nice. And so I had my buddy who was, because this is what, my fre- freshman year of high school? High school, okay. Yeah, so I have a buddy who's a, a senior in, in high school come by and bring me. I was like, I need to look nice. So he brought me a bunch of scarves <laughs> and ties. <laughs> <laughs> and I've spork up. Wrong <laughs> spork to drink water. <laughs> so I wore I wore a scarf and a and a sport coat to just go to my dad's apartment with this girl that yeah. we like we've oh, been kind dating. Of a scarf like a Johnny Depp scarf. I picked scarf a green or one. A, like it was a, a green. No, no, no. It was no, a winter no. scarf. It was a winter. And very you were trying to do it stylish. Something Hugh Grant would wear in a in a Christmas <laughs> Did movie. Did you have okay. a hilarious like <laughs> montage with your friend where you were trying on different scarves? Ties and, and like, scarves. Hundred no. <laughs> percent. A hundred percent. Are you wearing nice. a tie and a scarf? 
No, I'm wearing a scarf and uh, and I think just like a, a, a button up and then like a, a tweed like or a houndstooth sport coat. <laughs> yeah. 14. Yeah. And uh, oh and so God. we go you look over. like you've been collecting vinyl for 30 years. Oh, completely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, and so we go to my dad's place. I had a key. Um, I, and I think he he dropped us off because we didn't want to have the. Now, did your dad over. know what, was, what no. was about to go down? No, no, he was gone. Was he cool though with you having a girl over? Uh, yeah, he would have been fine with that. Okay. Anything to win my love back. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> anything. Yeah, I mean, I had a key to his condo, and he's like, anytime, come by anytime. Yeah. That thing after your parents get a divorce. Little side note is it, like I was at the age of, you know, I was like 13, 14 when they did. So then it's the like. Why don't, you, why don't you have a little glass of beer? Sure. You know, yeah, they're really yeah, trying yeah. to win you by start treating mm-hmm. you like a man. Hey, how about we go scarf shopping? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. He's like, you know, I could buy you one of those. Yeah, right? yeah, you don't yeah. got to borrow. Just just ask me. Mm-hmm. Just ask me next yeah. time. So we go over there, and I made her dinner. I made it. was just pasta, and, like, I've never cooked in my life. Yeah, yeah. I've never cooked in my life. So I just heated up, like, some ragu yeah, and, yeah. and pasta. I'm, it, I'm sure it was dog shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then I played – she said she was ready, and I played – Crash by Dave Matthews. Nice. Because I had heard I, that was a song about sex. You yeah. know, hike okay. up your skirt a little more. And do you know the song? No. I mean, very ballady, soft acoustic music. And I hit repeat on it, so we just loop on <laughs> iTunes. <laughs> nice. And we uh, and we had sex to uh, to Crash by Dave Matthews with a wow. belly full of pasta. Yeah. That I learned later. You don't do that. You don't carve up before sex. You know. Yeah. Yeah. I try not to eat. You know, yeah, like, totally. I, I want to be to fasted shake shit and look up, good. You know? yeah, 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 yeah. I've never thrown up off of a roller coaster, it'd be embarrassing to do it because oh, I just, because I just yeah. ate fast food and decided yes. to have sex 45 minutes later, yeah. you know. But then once you're in a relationship, you'll kind of just, yeah, like fucking, yeah, 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 roll yeah. on top of somebody. Oh, yeah, I've but yeah, we had gr- good sex. It was I told good my sex. girlfriend, like, just wait till I digest a little bit, yeah, you know, like you just mm-hmm. get to that point where you're like, yeah, I just ate, so we'll fuck, but you know. Um, okay, so what about any sort of a hoe phase? Did you go to college? You seem college okay. Never went to college. Um, Did you ever start just uh, fucking around? You know, you were a big Tinder guy or anything like anytime that? Anytime I'm not in a relationship, I am usually pretty You're pretty active. active. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But not on apps. This most recent time, I was not on apps. I would just meet girls yeah. wholesomely at shows. Yep. And uh, But I never had that before because I've always... Uh, I didn't do comedy before. So I was in okay. a relationship up until November. I was in a relationship the whole time I've done comedy up until November... And then I just started one again recently. Okay. So so in in between that. In period, between I mean, that, it was nice and easy though. Yeah, and I'd shows, meet people yeah. from shows. Before that though, I never had. I didn't really have male friends. I never had a group of friends, and so my entire social life was just setting up little like hookups hangs, on yeah, on yeah. Bumble and stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Because your uh, confidence is off the fucking charts. Oh, that, that's that's good. crazy. Yeah. yeah. I, mean, I I don't like. I don't sense any kind of shyness about you. No, but you know what, dude? I just did a wedding with uh with my girlfriend's family. So it was my first time meeting them. I have mm-hmm. a specific uh I I don't like being the center of attention when it's not uh when it's not what we do. Yeah. Yeah, like yeah. really uncomfortable, uh, like uh, perspiring discomfort. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I understand that, yeah. Yeah. All right, so it. it's all hyper focused into that. Yeah, so it like my, like this would be this would be my this is like a nightmare for me. Big table of people and I'm mm-hmm. not like super comfortable and then everybody turns to me and says like Oh, so we heard that you do comedy. Nightmare. How's that going? Uh, that is simple. Yeah. It's such a simple question. It's a fucking yeah. nightmare. I, it like it's hell on earth. Compresses me into some. I don't know what's happening because people don't understand your answer in the first place. The only way you can be is like, oh, it goes great. Yeah. You know, like people were asking me like how my move to Austin yeah. has been going and stuff. And if I tell you the details of it, like how like oh, it's slower get slow start getting stage time. It sucks starting a new scene yeah. and stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no fucking point in me telling my family that. I know. Yeah. They're dumb yeah. as shit. Like I know. You just be they like, don't know. Great. Yeah. Great. The, the only thing anybody cares about hearing is great. And you, you say know? great. See, I I'll, I kind of do the opposite, which I've worked on, which is I always feel the need to like qualify it as if they know, and I go like. Yeah, I mean, because like this question, like, so you're, like you're doing comedy full time. I was like, well, full time implies I'm making money off it. You yeah. know, this thing takes yeah. like years to do. So it's like, when is art ever going great? You know, I do yeah. that, which is almost the yeah. opposite. And I'm like, why am I doing this? Yeah. They just want to hear like, yeah, I'm myself over explaining to people who just don't fucking understand. It doesn't you know? Yeah. yeah. All, All right. right so, so have you ever fucked an object? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dude. I knew you would. Yeah. Blankets, yeah. beds. I think you started. Pillows. No, I told yeah, you. Yeah. I dated an Asian. You one. know what? Let's yeah. re. Let's re. I'm gonna ask a question again. What was your <laughs> what was your favorite object to fuck is actually what I should ask. Um, lifeless doll like Asian gal. <laughs> 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 Me and you both. Yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah. Um, oh, 
Uh, there was a my sister had this big stuffed horse. <laughs> this bestiality. Dog. Me and my buddy would run trains <laughs> you and your on friend, this thing. Share it, me and my buddy Evan around. would smash this thing to bits. We cut a little slit course, where the yeah. fucking horse uh, pussy would be. Yeah. And I've gone on record saying this in the past. <laughs> I have. I've had. I had some. Fake horse sex that was better than like some real sex I've had later I on as an adult. It, it was I good. Bet. I believe it. It was bet. so good. <laughs> Dude, you're so creative. Yeah. Pre real yeah. sex. You'll I used to be out. able to imagine Megan Fox with me. Like, yeah. I used to be yeah. able to. Yeah. She was there, you know? Yes. Like, <laughs> I, am, I imagine that this horse was a uh, spirit stallion of the Cimarron. Like, I just, <laughs> I was there. Uh, what's was this awesome. horse up to now? Uh, you know what's funny? I blamed it on because because my mom, my mom and sister like identified that there's like this a horse slit full in it. of gum. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're like, why is the filling all hard just towards the end? Yeah, hey, I went to clean your horse and I'm pregnant now. So. <laughs> <laughs> Which is like a gross, like, <laughs> like a, a weird like, like Akita type horse baby. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I blamed it all on the guy. And then it wasn't until like just in the last two years that I told my sister. I was like, so guy, your friend? Yeah, yeah. I was yeah. like, dude, I, I, he had told me he was going to do that, but I thought it was a joke. I, I gave him more information. I could have just been like, I don't know. Yeah. But instead, I was like, he carved it into a pussy and fucked it. Yeah. <laughs> and he was like our neighbor. He saw him to like come around, you know? And I just, I Trigger knew that they knew that every year. about like, him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. You ever come on your own face? Uh, yeah, I think when I was younger and it's all like packed up, yeah. I've had it like hit chin. Never really? in adulthood though? No, I don't. I don't, I'm not blasting like that. Do you, so you blast on yourself? Uh, on the stomach. Yeah. You on the stomach? And I okay. Wipe it up. Yeah. I wipe it up like a bitch. Where's the weird? Where's like the the weirdest place you ever had sex? Oh, good could question. be uh yeah like I said um <clears throat> could be in the car in the car you or, know at yeah. a specific parking lot that's like whoa yeah, we did this yeah, at yeah, Red yeah. Olive. Look. Um, Red Olive. <laughs> it's a diner in Detroit. Nice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Red Olive. <laughs> um. God, weirdest weirdest place that I've had sex. Um, I can't think of. I, this is what's coming to mind, and this isn't weird, but it was like more scenic and beautiful. But one time, I we took um, uh, my family had a cabin out in eastern Washington, so like beautiful, like snow mountains. Like mm. you look outside, and there's postcard. no other cabins. Here. Yeah, postcard, just yeah. snow falling down. Like, but and um, and me and my girlfriend at the time took the snowmobile and just went, just went and climbed the mountain out, out, out. Um, brought like a bottle of whiskey with us, and it was probably like one in the morning. It's not just stars, yeah, Whoa. just stars and snow. It's awesome, yeah. And uh, and we had sex out there. That's so that was just all beautiful. Cold? Wow. Yeah. Perfect. Were you wearing top layers coats? Perfect silence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Top layers top coats, layers but coat. yeah, yeah. Just perfect silence out in the snow. That's a beautiful Whoa. answer. Yeah, yeah that's, that's beautiful. Yeah, yeah. We usually get like J.C. Penny changing room or something. <laughs> like, I, I had a girl. Uh, uh, I was actually in. I was in rehab and uh, and they let my girlfriend visit when I was like sixteen. Yeah. My like a high school girlfriend yeah. I had, and they let me have a day pass to like go out and do stuff. Sweet. And we went to Nordstrom. And um and she started sucking me off in the changing room and then and they and they were banging they on knew. the thing and I'm like our fucking chat like they know yeah, yeah they know yeah. what's happening absolutely here. Yeah. yeah yeah but you're some punky <clears throat> rehab sixteen oh, year totally. old kid I'm all just like dude just fuck <laughs> off man just let us I'm trying on a scarf <laughs> yeah you're at most three months clean you know <laughs> oh, like uh, twenty days yeah, yeah. yeah you're yeah. not thinking of shadows at that point no exactly. <laughs> which by I the way the shadow. if you're in a uh, like a thing like a bathroom stall I learned this uh, the hard way thank God I never got caught but I used to be a janitor at this uh, this uh, like a warehouse up in uh, Carlsbad and I used to just I had, my job was easy I didn't do anything so I would just kill time and I would just watch porn in the bathroom and I would jerk yeah, off sure like, a, a couple lot. times a shift more than I'm comfortable with admitting to definitely any. more than once a shift uh, no just once a shift for sure <laughs> but like every day it was insane <laughs> yeah. so but one time I was in the bathroom and I just realized because there's nobody else in the bathroom regular stall then a handicap stall and I noticed when I was in the handicap stall, all of a sudden I was like just kind of like doing like this, like an overhand, yeah. you know, not like extreme. But I just look over and oh you could God. see my shadow in the other yes. stall. And I was like, if anybody Wait, you was, were doing this, I was like, yeah, like looking at my phone and like kind of doing like. Why are you doing is this? That? The, is this how you jack off? No, are you pulling out a katana. Sometimes why I just like, like why is this the way you're mimic like gorilla so, jacking? I, off? That's how I was doing it's it. Sometimes, I just, no. sometimes yeah. I just change it up every now and again. That's not how I finish it all, but you know, that's fucking. What do you mean? Do you really? You like to, to turn it you over? You do a little twist time action was, on yourself. Yeah. yeah, every now and again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Wow. I remember my brother telling me a new technique called the helicopter, where you just over your. And I didn't oh, like it. Yeah. I, didn't I don't like, like it. it either. Yeah, I got a sensitive sucks. head. You yeah, know? <laughs> it actually sucks ass to do. Uh, okay, so let's see. What was the last question? That's so in your bloodline. 
to like the pressure. I know, the, but you know what? I think it's like, oh, I've had this. <laughs> oh, I've had this <laughs> Been before. here, done yeah, that. I've yeah. been doing this since you were in diapers, my friend. Have you ever bailed? Like, has something, like, awful happened or you got so turned off or you're in a situation where you were just like, I'm out, like, in the middle of sex? Yeah, she started crying. Really? Whoa. Yeah. yeah. You want to tell it? Yeah, I mean that that was really like it. Like I I didn't I didn't yeah, coerce her or anything. Who was, was this person? Why it was did the girl you start who would, I would later end up dating and we fucked on the snowmobile. But um, okay, oh, I thought you were gonna say it was the horse. But why? <laughs> 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 the horse. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to fuck? Nah. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're, we're doing it anyway. So maybe it's nah. I wasn't yes. actually expecting an answer. Um, <laughs> so what happened? No, well, just... I I think that she was a massive whore. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> truly, and I think she she really liked me, and I think she uh, didn't like that she was putting out already. Uh, okay, so it yeah. was. Yeah. Oh, she started uh, crying. She she I started, cry- started no, crying. No, she started crying. I stopped and I was like, "What's wrong?" And then she was like, "She was like, no, 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 nothing. Don't worry about it." And I was like, I "We're mean, not that's gonna. That's fuck crazy. Keep doing yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. Like, um, would it help if I cried too? I do. Totally. I mean, it was <laughs> because I really liked her too. Yeah. And uh, and so I and I was like really pumped that this was finally happening. Mm-hmm. I'd been. Not just working on the pussy, but I'd been working on her for like a couple months. Yeah, and she had told uh, me at one point I just want to be friends, and then came back. I was like, well, I think I like you. It was like yeah. this weird up and down thing, and then we're finally I was like, oh, it's happening. Like, yeah, yeah. And then she started uh, crying, and I was like, oof, that's a tough one. Yeah. Okay, well then maybe uh, hit me with the biggest simp that you've ever been. You ever you ever oh. been real hardcore? What's the most you've most effort you ever put in? Yeah, dude. maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You cross state lines like Joe did. So, so you know how I told you that guy, uh, uh, Josh. Desmond, who would later become a gangster's disciple, I would yes. keep coming up in my. So there was this perpetual love that I had. We're still, we're still friends today, but this girl named uh, a different girl named Sarah, not the one I who kissed my penis in kindergarten. <laughs> Sarah Jones, a, a awesome girl, and I loved her. I loved her off and on all through from junior high all the way Life through high push. school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and we're always good friends, but she'd always really tease the idea of her liking me. Mm-hmm. Um, but she dated. Uh, I mean, God, my my simping for her is like the story last year. So I'll try to just hit some interesting bullet points. Mm-hmm. Um, she dated my older brother's really good friend. So when I was like in the eighth grade, he was a senior in high school. Okay. This guy named Cameron, and he was he lived at my house. He was over all the time, and I would watch him like cheat on her and like fuck around but he was also he was cool to me he was like family yeah, like he was yeah. always over and it just killed me that yeah. she was a freshman yeah. i was in eighth grade he was a senior and she dated him and she fucking loved cameron she would cut herself oh, because he cheated on her God. and it would just destroy me and then she would like just hang out with me because she knew i loved her so much but yeah. th- just as a friend yeah. just and bitch about him yeah so one night she uh mm-hmm. when you know they're they're broken up she reaches out to me, and uh, she was going to sneak out and take her sister's car and come pick me up. So this was a big deal. Nice. And I was like, and she's been leaving me hints that she likes that me. She would make comments and being like, maybe I need to, like, date somebody a little bit younger. Happen. You know? Yeah. I'm like, also, it's funny when girls do that. It's like, you're 14, I'm 13. But yeah. it's like, maybe I should go for a younger man, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Not like a 23-year-old. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. And so she, uh, she came, and she picked me up, and we were... Uh, driving she's like do you want to go get like ice cream or something or go down to the beach and i'm like i mean this is happening this Mm -hmm. is fucking huge for me yeah and then she starts talking about cameron and how heartbroken she is and then we we get on the freeway which is not anywhere near ice cream or the beach Uh and then i'm i I know what's happening and my heart's racing in my chest and i go what um where are we going she's like oh we're just gonna make a a quick stop and i sit there in silence as blink 182 is when the self-titled the blink 182 the album had come out which song Uh, I, it was the whole album playing, but I'm sure it was like, like violence, yeah. you kill me. And I'm just yeah. sitting in the freeway and I know what's happening. And he also lives like 35 minutes away. Oh, Jesus so Christ. I'm just there in silence and we pull up to his place. It's now probably like 1, 1.30 in the morning yeah. on a school night, no less. And then she goes in there and is in there for like Jesus a long an hour. Time. And yes. I just sit. God I sit it. in the car. Yep. No cell phone. And we drive. No. Yeah, no cell phone, nothing. Uh. I just sit there and we drive back in silence. And uh, and then her dad was waiting for us outside of my house. So then I like got in trouble. Yeah, oh. it was like you snuck out with my daughter, and I'm like, oh. brother, you have no idea. <laughs> I, <laughs> like, yeah, I, I, I can show you to Cameron's guy. house if yeah, you want, exactly. because this is the guy you want to. The talk guy you want to wanna talk to is an adult on his way to college, <laughs> yeah. and um, so that broke my heart. And then, uh, uh, and then, so that's like number one. And then a few years later, I remember kind of same deal. 
we go, we hang out late at night. Now we're like in high school. And she somehow, we, we went to different schools. She hasn't, or uh, she went to a different school than this guy, Josh Desmond, who used to fuck my ex, also named Sarah, the Japanese girl. Okay. She has, I don't know how she ever got in contact it's with this guy. It's the unshakable Josh Dude, Desmond. Dude, Josh Desmond <laughs> is <laughs> everywhere. And she. Um, He's constantly fucking the girls you want to fuck. Dude, yeah. it sucks. Ruin, he fucks all the Sarahs wow. that I love. And, uh, and I remember, so this is a couple years later now, so like. Whatever, the things uh, time has passed, and we're hanging out at the beach. Now we made it as far as the beach, and it's late at night. And she's talking about, um, she's like, I'm so tired and sore. And I'm like, mm -hmm. why? And she's like, <laughs> I went to this guy Josh Desmond's house last night, and we just fucked until seven in the morning. And I'm like, so cool. Oh, awesome. So yeah. fucking cool, great. Dude. Yeah, good for you. So cool. cool. Fucking break your pencil. I mean, <laughs> just so, yeah. so frustrating. <laughs> Uh, but I simped, I oh. simped after her for a long time. When I got, I got sent away to like one of those boarding school rehabs, and she wrote me a letter. And in the letter, uh, it was I was so excited that she sent me something, and I was like, "Oh my God, Sarah Jones wrote me!" Mm -hmm. And in it, she goes like, "I'm I'm so blessed and grateful that I met you." And I was like, "Oh, here we go." She goes, "Because if it wasn't for you, I never, I never met Josh. Not Josh, <laughs> a different guy that she was saying. She's like, I never would have met Willie." If it oh wasn't for God. you, and I was Some just like, guy. I like it's Jesus so hurtful. Christ. It's so hurtful. You looked at the note, like, is this come on the note? Yeah, like, yeah, what yeah, is yeah. this? This sucks. But God I damn. always was in her orbit. I would always come back. Yeah. Like uh, back and yeah. she could have called me at any time. And Off I'd and on simp. Yeah. That's brutal, dude. Yeah. Oh, okay. So what is what's the worst thing you've ever done to get off? You was there ever something that like you really regret doing in order to to, to, to get che I mean, cheating. Cheating's cheating. the obvious answer yes. for sure. But um, you ever fuck a friend's like sister or something like that? Somebody you shouldn't yeah. fuck? Friend's mom? I'll, I'll tell you guys a story about this. wasn't for me to get off, but I actually think it's the worst thing I've ever done. Uh, and I've done a lot of bad, you know, I was, I was a junkie sure. for a long time. We I've stolen have. a lot. Yeah. I've betrayed yeah. a lot of people's mm -hmm. trust. This one was enough where I reached out to her years later and apologized. And I was like, I mean, wow, like what an asshole move. There was this girl who really liked me. Um, named named Lily, and I was living with this guy named Alex, who was a, a like really depressed stoner, like really overweight Jewish guy, and he just had no pull with with women. But he would have he had this cool. His parents paid for him to have this. He had this nice apartment. I was like eight, eighteen. He was nineteen. He had this really nice apartment, and so he would just throw these parties and invite. This is also in like Orange County. California, mm -hmm. so Costa Mesa. Yeah, it's Costa Mesa. Yeah. So it's like Newport would, Beach and he, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he was. Uh, he would have all these like just beautiful like Latin girls come over, but everyone just used this place to party and smoke yeah. weed, and he yeah. could never fuck any of them. And I would, Damn, yeah, I would okay. sometimes fuck some of them, um, not often, but sometimes. Damn, he was like a simp on a really wide like huge, yeah. huge simp. So Plain. there was this girl named named Lily who just was just loved me, and it, it was that sort of thing where it's like we hooked up. And then I was like, dude, I don't want to date you. She was very obnoxious, very yeah. clingy, very psycho, all those things. Like yeah. she came in one time and saw that I had a girl on my lap and she threw a beer at the girl's head. Okay. Yeah, like yeah, she was yeah. she was nuts. I didn't really want anything. But then, you know, when she was sober, she was nice enough. And I felt sure. bad because she, she did really like me. And I would hook up with her sometimes when she would come around if she was the best available option. Okay. So that was all very uncool. Yeah. But anyways, uh, she lived in L.A. proper. So she lived a good... What is that? Like 45 hour with traffic, maybe about more. an hour and a half, about four hour and a half. Yeah, yeah. Room. So she lived pretty far. I didn't have a car. Alex had a car. Alex really likes Lily. Yeah, <laughs> he really likes Lily. And Lily is obsessed with his friend who's sleeping on his couch. Alex is no quitter. And he's you know? <laughs> no quitter. And he's talking to her and he's like, is really trying to make something happen. And he goes, Spencer doesn't even fucking like you. He hooks up with all these other chicks. And I'm just trying to to defend myself and i'm like you know I, i'd be texting her on the side and be like that's not true lily like i think you're a great person blah 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 anyways at one point she starts teasing she starts teasing the idea to alex and being like well i don't think i would like necessarily hook up with just you but like maybe like a threesome or something if spencer was into it and alex comes to me with this and he goes i i want you to make this happen okay for me. Yeah. He goes, I really want to fuck Lily. She, it, this is so simple of him because he was like, she will never hook up with me. Yeah. She's not unless, interested. I'm, unless she's fucking somebody she's actually attracted to. If you're fucking to her, her yeah. she'll, she'll suck Damn. my dick. All right. And so I was living, things were, get, were, were actually, I was, him and I were starting to get into heroin again yeah, together. Okay, yeah. I was going to ask if drugs were involved. Yeah, things yeah. were starting to get sketchy. He was never a junkie, but he was starting to experiment. Sure. Um, things were getting really sketchy with just between me and him and me living there because yeah. I wasn't paying rent. Yeah. And, mm -hmm. 
but I'm sure I was shitty. He was an asshole. Like, sure. and so I was like, I'm going to get kicked out of this place soon. So I reach out to Lily and I'm like, listen, um, uh, you know, she tells me, she goes, I have no interest in doing the threesome. I'm just doing it because I want him to still come and be willing to come pick me up so I can come hang out with you. That's Ooh. the only reason I'm saying this. I'm never actually going to do it. And I go, listen, because oh, I'm trying to protect myself. I'm going to get yeah. like, I, I can feel that I'm about to get kicked out of this guy's apartment and be fucking homeless. So I'm like, listen, um, I don't want to see you with anybody else. You know, I like you. <laughs> He's not going to let me use his car to come see you. I won't get to see you anymore if you don't actually do this. So I think I think we need to make this happen. Uh, okay. And I was really just trying to save yeah, my yeah. own skin yeah, and, get, and yeah, deliver for, sure. for okay. my buddy. Yeah. And uh, and we did do it. And it was super uncomfortable. We drove down to her place. It was really awkward. I hated it. Yeah. I couldn't get it up. Jeez. Long drive, yeah, too, yeah. for it. She blew this fucking guy. And then and I never hung out with her again. After that. But so he got what he wanted. He, he got, got what he came he for. He got right? what he wanted and was an asshole about it. Like, oh. when he came, he immediately gets up. He, like, doesn't say anything to her, and he leaves the room and, like, slams the door. He was, like, a pouty bitch because he's, like, she's not into me. She's not showing yeah, me. He re- everything oh came up God. here. Every- exactly. Yeah, everything exactly. Happened. She's, like, he, he, she's doing – she's more interested in Spencer. She's not even giving me attention. Yeah. This was, like, a, a loveless suck. So Did he ev- abandon you or anything? <laughs> no, or he, he, he goes outside, and then I get up, and I was, like, you know what? Hey, I'm going to go. And she's, like, you're, you're leaving? And she goes, no, like, fuck me. Whoa. And then I do. And then I at least was like, we should fucking stay here. We can't just leave. That feels yeah. so yeah, mean. Yeah. And he was like, he's like, he's like, no, we're going like we're, we're leaving. Yeah. And I remember Jesus her Christ. just being sad. And I was like, this is the worst thing I've ever done. This song. Yeah. It's so mean. So everybody lost pretty much. Everybody <clears throat> lost. Damn. Yeah. All right. So mean, worst thing I've ever done to not really get myself off, but somebody else was. Yeah, there, for sure. Also, what's your heart out? What time is it now? It's 823 right now. I probably got till 845. Oh, okay. Oh, great. Cool. Yeah. Great, yeah. great, 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 great. Oh, it's a full hour. Okay, yeah, yeah. awesome. Yeah, Again, good halfway point apology to everybody involved. Uh, <laughs> super fucking sorry to everybody here. Yeah. Uh, and then strip clubs. Yeah, I don't like them. You don't like them? No. Prostitutes? Uh, I've never intentionally seen one. Okay. Yeah. Now, I'm not that, a, that mean... I'm not opposed to. If I was mm-hmm. like older guy single, whatever yeah. the circumstance. Yeah. I've never yeah, had yeah. to, and I'm not opposed. Strip clubs, I don't. I don't like it. It feels uncomfortable. Yeah. yeah. Strip clubs are actually a lot weirder than like sex work stuff. I agree. It yeah. Does. yeah it feels... You're paying for the prom, you're like this promise of sex and it's fake. Well, it's and... this environment, this really grimy environment where <clears throat> if it's a sex worker, it's just you and her. You yeah. figure it out, you know? Yeah. So, yeah, there's not a whole thing. Um, let's see. Has anybody asked you something uh, to do during sex that caught you way off guard? Yeah, craziest ask. <sighs> Man, I'm not like, <clears throat> until re- even sometimes just like, I, I, this is like hacky. I feel like we've heard this as a bit a thousand times, but even yeah. just like, a, what do you want to do to me? I'm like, I don't know, man. Right. Yeah. Wanna, yeah. Not yeah. really looking to like get descriptive. Yeah. You know, yeah, just yeah. regular stuff. You style, feel like there's a regular. right answer to that, you know? Yeah, like, oh, I know. Yeah. I know. Because also, I feel like even if I said, like, I, w- I want you to put in your. Put in your ass. He's yeah. just like, oh no. Is that what you want to do? <laughs> yeah. Are yeah, you... I mean, maybe that's like the mo- other You're than a okay, butt w- fucking kind of son of a gun. Not even really. I've barely done it. But like, if we're having sex, and then she goes like, I like the son of a gun, butt yeah. fucking son of a gun. Yeah. <laughs> Are you a doggone butt fucker? <laughs> yeah. You a BFSG? Friggin', yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm a I'm a butt frigger. Yeah. No, I, I've barely done it, but I feel like if you're already having Is it vaginal sex, you like though. I'm Are, interested in the it, idea. Of, it releases sexual dopamine for you. That yes. You're like, nice. Mostly you know? just the like, idea of them like lining it up. I don't even really okay. need to. Just be, them being open to okay. it, I guess. Do you hot. lick butts? I will, yeah. You, do you, like now, them. do you get anything about your butt touch? Um, no, I, I'll, I'll let them like do stuff to it i've never really found that it does anything for me what do you mean what do you mean you'll <laughs> let them do stuff to it <laughs> like if they it's, want to you're like i don't mind if if, if, so i need to know how much now though if they put I, their hand in the back and they start like fingering my like tickling asshole. the hole tickling yeah the actual I'm, hole. i'll let them because i'm thinking this is turning you on it doesn't sure. really do anything for yeah, me yeah, yeah. but i also don't want to say no because i don't want them to feel Inhibited because yeah, it, it doesn't you don't want to be like anything yo freak you know exactly like, and i and i like doing it to them so i get it yeah and i don't want them okay. to not let me because they're like well you don't let me do it to you so yeah. i leave it all on the table and i'm okay. open to getting it eaten and it's just never happened it's never happened no really with all the okay somebody will hmm. and it's going to change your life really are you I'll big t- on it yeah uh about up to here maybe in my butt can yeah. go and tongue and tickle i don't like getting penetrated really yeah. I don't like getting fucked. You know, I don't mm-hmm. want to get fucked, but definitely touch it. 
Definitely yeah. touch around there, you know? Now, let me ask you this. If I'm not super hot on uh, on just having it even touched, am I going to like the tonguing? You probably will. What What do you mean you don't like it? even the gentle tickle? Like you, Again, so I don't mind balls, it. Tongue maybe. is different than a finger, though. Fingers hard and kind of yeah. stay, A tongue is like soft. It just doesn't feel stimulating sexually. Like, I'm not like, oh, and I'm going to come she's touching uh, my ass. You've got to like, work okay. your way to a full-on lick. You know, yeah. like see that this is like I'm smiling now because it's getting me sexually excited. <laughs> the idea of the like the kissing down yeah, to it, I'm more interested down in there that. Is good. Yeah, you yeah. start to like that, and then it the, you can't just go full on lick. Now, can you I know? ask you something? I'm so hairy, so I'm like, I don't. Is that this that's, a thing where you, that's at a woman's discretion? I don't know. Yeah. Women love hair. Mm-hmm. Some women love hair. Some women are are not freaks about hair. You yeah. know. I'm virtually hairless, you know. That's I've got what a I'm looking body at. Yeah, type, and I feel you know? like maybe you have a really nice looking ass. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know because I shit crazy, but what I keep it clean. I keep yeah. myself clean yeah, because I know what I to like. Get, there's nothing to catch it. No hair. Yeah, that's yeah. the thing. Honestly, yeah. that's the or thing. butt cheeks at all. <laughs> yeah, like, it's yeah. like a when a horse shits. It's just like <laughs> yeah, yeah. you basically just have a drain on your. Yeah, back. like when, uh, what's it called? If uh, airplane dumped luggage in a movie, you ever seen that? You know, like the back of the airplane lowers and suitcases and like fucking shit. You know, <laughs> people's luggage falls yeah. out of your ass. <laughs> yeah. What's the uh, grossest thing you've ever encountered? The grossest the thing grossest. I've ever encountered. Uh, you be during sex, obviously. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh yeah. gotcha. Could um, be like an environment. Now, this can go back to you know because uh, we've also both struggled with addiction. You know, yeah. so like we love getting to talk to another person because mm-hmm. that can bring even worse shit out. Mm-hmm. You know. Yeah. Is it like a? Did you ever fucking like a fucked up environment? Like a like a really gross place. Here's here's the grossest, and this might not necessarily be what you're because I really haven't. When people talk about like a fucking nasty pussy, I've I've really I've been with a lot of them. Smelly I've pussy ne- is a common answer to our. But question. I've never really mm-hmm. felt that. Even it's like oh, it might smell a little strong of pussy, but I've never I've never like smelled a pussy that was like oof. Not like, like bacteria vaginosis. No, or I've never run called. into that. Like, I really I, okay. like in my opinion, it's la- and I'll, I'll fucking. I'll eat out like on the period and stuff. Like I don't, mm. uh, I'm not, I'm not sheepish about that stuff. Sure. But uh, probably was uh, like smoking crack and having a <clears throat> who I who I found out was a hooker. But when I met her, I was so high on crack. I just it was just a lady who was. I didn't even your understand dick, what was though. going on. I was just like, yeah, you want to get a fucking yeah, let's rock sure, up and yeah, smoke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I remember, and she kind of smelled sweet because she was homeless, so she smelled not great. And I and her just trying to fucking suck my flaccid dick yeah. with a condom barely on it yeah, yeah like she puts a condom but it's a tiny yeah. little so it's just yep. it's mostly she's just sucking on a condom that's barely yeah. unwrapped yeah been there and and i'm just rocked out and the sun's coming up and i like i have work in yeah 90 this minutes. is why i'm sober that's pretty, now that's this pretty, is yeah. exactly why i'm sober now saying like, it makes me want to yeah, kill myself yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah it's bad uh, we all i believe all three of us <laughs> <laughs> might yeah. have yep. seen that same sunrise Dude. Dude. Same. oh were you guys crack guys no i was coke yeah, yeah the I was, same shit. I never yeah. dropped down to meth and stuff like that. I yeah. think I was about to. You know, I got offered meth two times and turned it down. Yeah. But I was an all coke guy. It could have gotten way worse. You know, it could have yeah. gone way downhill. I got to rehab in time. Awful. But awful. I well, see, that. That, that's a good answer because it's not only gross, like physically, but mentally. Mentally, and it's like you put yourself. Yeah, it's like, it's like it's where thing were is you, dude? Yeah. Like, it makes me sick. Yeah, yeah. and it's, so it's so sad to talk about. You the know, the aftermath of that was then uh, I was like, hey, I like I I gotta go. I'm I'm rocked out, and, I re- and my hands are shaking. I'm trying to yeah. like do the push yeah, on the crack where you push yeah, the brillo yeah. back and forth because there's no crack left. I know, so you're trying yeah. to, you don't know what else to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And uh, and then does and then, crack have resin? Yeah, yeah. So you guys it's can smoke black. that resin. Yes. Yeah, but you get by, about the, one by the hit. time you're okay. the, like you've already been so high, the resin really isn't doing anything. It's not. For it's you. just yeah, give yeah. me one more thing. Mm-hmm. Okay. And uh, and I'm trying to leave, and uh, and I was like, I have to go. Like I've I've fucking I've work. <laughs> oh god <laughs> work. i have like a tech sales job i have to get oh, to oh, god. and then she was like you need to she goes well like like you need to pay me and i was like what what and i'm mm. and she goes you have you have to pay me i just spent all night right away because you can tell she's used to this yeah right away getting very a little defensive <laughs> but well, she that like, means she <laughs> has a very nondescript <laughs> sales pitch that means there was she's, no pitch. Uh, that means yeah. she's going she's like yeah, I'll suck your dick and you know, me fifty. The yeah. black guy. Yeah, 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 like, you, know. you want to know what's crazy? This is what's crazy about it. it. The the this is why I said I've never gotten a hooker intentionally. The black guy I bought crack from, and was I was smoking. This is like I'm just smoking with homeless people on the streets mm-hmm. of San Francisco. Yeah, yeah. He goes, he goes, you want to meet a friend? And I was like, 
Yeah, I'll fucking meet a friend. Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll meet everybody. You're, right answering, now. Yeah. <laughs> You're answering genuinely. And yeah, 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 I'll yeah, start yeah. a fucking mm. uh, you know an acapella group with you, right? Now. I'll <laughs> yeah, do whatever. Yeah, yeah. And then he and I meet this incredibly mid crackhead, and I was and then he fucking dips. And I'm like, you're yeah. lucky that she was mid. You and yeah. I are smoking, yeah. you know. Yeah. And then she goes, you want to get a room? And I'm like, well, that makes sense. What are we gonna just be out here all yeah. night? <laughs> and oh then <laughs> you're like Mr. <laughs> yeah, you're like Mr. Magooing your way into. A... <laughs> yeah, I'm dodging. I'm just stepping on alligators that are about to eat me and shit, dodging cars. God damn. So then we get back to the hotel. And we're smoking for a while and talking. We're having what I thought was pretty good simulating conversation. Sure. And then she starts kissing my neck, and I wasn't into it at all. And I start making out with her and finger- I thought I was doing her a favor. Yeah. Yeah. You were like, so I guess I got to fuck When she asked me for money, yeah, yeah, I was yeah, like, yeah. I kissed you. Like, yeah, I didn't yeah. even uh-huh. want this, you yeah, know? Yeah. And uh, and then she w- anyway goes to, like, you can't do this to me, blah, 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 blah. Did you and have I- money to give her? Yeah, I took her to the ATM, and I gave her $40. Okay. Wow. And I yeah. was like. That's this- not the end of the world. That's not yeah. the end of the world for her. As, no. You know, like, that probably hurt you pretty bad at the time. Yeah, maybe, yeah. It was, you know? it was like, like Was really there my last ever a moment in that, like, that, I assume a motel room or whatever, where you're hanging out with she's and this this crackhead is just sucking your flaccid condom dick, where you ever thought, like I came so far from that horse. You know what I mean? Like I've just come so long. How did I get here? I used to oh. fuck a beautiful stallion. God dude, damn it, I missed dude. What spirit. happened to me? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was so much better. Damn, that's wild. It was simpler. Spirit never asked for money. Great answer. She just wanted fucking hot, hard cock. Yeah, that's she, all yeah. That she was wanted. very, yeah. Man, dude, yeah. didn't know what you have. Um, so this is a new question I thought today. We mm-hmm. never asked anybody this, but I think it's kind of interesting because I well, so basically, what, what wouldn't do it be you... funny if he was just like, where do you get your jokes from? You get <laughs> what, what, <laughs> if he started doing what drives them, yeah. you to write your jokes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, what do you think about while you're having sex? Because it's not you don't just think about wh- what you're doing. No, I your do. mind. You do. I'm an animal, I do. dude. I do. Okay, I tap right, in hit me completely. With it. Yeah. Okay. Same. All right. You I'm don't watching. It, I'm. Can I, I? Can I? Because because what I think about is like I'll think about like scenarios. Mm-hmm. You know, I'll p- add a little fantasy onto it. Like my girlfriend's not my girlfriend. It's like the sister of my girlfriend. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And we have to fuck before she gets home. That's like awesome. I get it. One time I saw our shadows on the wall and I was it made me come. I was like I don't know why. Why do oh, I? Oh, like look this? at the shadows. That's cool. The yeah. shadows is you cool. Know? Shadows, you guys don't ever like think about like other shit. I use it as a practice in mindfulness. <laughs> I tell you, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Really? I like. I, I make an effort to. I'm like. I only want to think about the physical sensations. Okay. That are okay. In front of me. All right. The yeah, only yeah. thing I can think of is pushing animals off the bed. The only thing is like I'll be like, oh, oh cat, like fuck. A cat, yeah. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like no, I tap in completely. Okay. Um, yeah. Like, I feel like my in. eyes get glossy. Like, okay. Uh, yeah. 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 But yeah. you don't ever think about like porn scenarios or anything. No. no. Oh, okay. All I right. spray silver on my mouth. I go sweat. Yeah. Me. And yeah. Then I just fuck. <laughs> you blood bag it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> blood bag. <it. laughs> okay. Nice, dude. Um. What's it called? I felt like I fucking. I did have. We've. We. We're missing a lot of them right now. Uh, we are. Well, I'll tell you yeah. this. Settle an argument between me and Tim. Do you yeah. jerk? Have you ever jerked off and drove? While I was driving, yeah, uh, not full jerking off. No, not I've full. I've like played with my cock, but no. okay, all right. I'm just wondering because he yeah. he does it a lot. Says it's normal. I think it's weird. A lot is a crazy. big yeah. word. It's no, that's a, so lot, crazy. a lot. It's not that crazy. Okay, Do, I mean, have you done it in the last year? <clears throat> Oh yeah! Oh, that's crazy. Oh, that's yeah. crazy. Oh, that's last crazy. How long? Five days. Yeah. Do you think he was late? <laughs> <laughs> Circling the block. <laughs> I'm whole, forty minutes I'm away. I'm forty. I'm trying to roll a joint with one hand, drive with the other, and jack Shift off. Were you fucking with octopus? My foot? Yeah. <laughs> I'm forty. Minutes Yo, you're so much an octopus. Joe might try to fuck you. Come on, Japanese stuff. God damn. <clears throat> uh, do you have a fetish? Something that you like? And it can be, I'm talking boobs or butt too. Like, uh, like I mean, like yeah. I, the question boob man asked, man, that is more cringe than saying. Yeah. Because like, I feel like I really, mine switches between boob and butt. And then I'm always blowjob. Blowjob is my number one. Really? Yeah, I love blowjob. Mm. I like blowjob. You know what I've really been enjoying lately? And I, I have a, I have a hand jobs. So here's the thing. I, I have a theory on this. So. Girls, it's the first thing that they're willing to do is give like a, a hand job when we're young, middle school, mm-hmm. high school, whatever. And then we go, well, that's something I can do myself. What you really want is to lose your virginity, get your fucking suck job. Mm-hmm. That's what you want. So then we go, why would I want something I can do myself? Like yeah. women aren't even good at it. Just give me. And so women hear that at a really early age. And then they just decide it's off the table well into adulthood. The number of relationships I've been in, hookups I've had, where it's like it really is me doing stuff to them, then maybe a blowjob, maybe not, and then sex. And then I I decided to just be vocal about that. It's like it, just it's jacket, awesome. Yeah. I love it. 
and get mm-hmm. and so that's I what jack I enjoy. Off. Interesting. Yeah. After sex, I, I <coughs> will finish. It's I always I usually tend to jack off for at least a few minutes. I like getting my balls licked or my nipples touched yeah. or like my just rubbed and looked at. Yeah, you well, know? I want like, I want to be. Why can't I feel? You sexy? should jack off. The, yeah. the Louis C.K. <laughs> fetish is not that bad. No, <laughs> no, but no, I'm saying them to me a hand job. I'm saying them like looking, yeah. looking at me and and jacking, or, or better yet, looking at it, at it, yeah, and, smiling at the reaction yeah. of the pulses, oh, yeah. Come on, but oh, do do you like eye contact during sex? Yeah, really. I'll, I'll say, I'll sometimes I'll, I'll say like, look at me, look at me. I yeah. fucking hate it, dude. I said I witnessed. I hate it, it so. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, look at what I'm doing, dude. You know why? Well, it's because I make a lot of weird. Fa- I have to make weird faces to come let's eventually. See it. And <laughs> let's see. It. Oh, oh, you you have to work into it like. And you I, have a mustache. I have to like <laughs> when you make a weird face with a mustache, it's sort of outlining the weird face <gasps> yeah, that yeah, you're yeah. making. I look like a guy on a pizza box when I come. <laughs> <laughs> fat Italian dude. One one eyes closed, you're going, yeah. hey. <laughs> <laughs> Thirty minutes or it's free. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, so like I don't that's why I love doggy style because you can't look at me and I can make all the weird I faces. I don't like I want. doggy style because we're not connected. Ah, there you go. Yeah. See, I almost like the the unconnected, like it just seems like a very like prime. I am all like, yeah, fuck you. I, you I like that, too. But I have to, But if yeah, I had to yeah, pick yeah. one to live with, mm-hmm. it would be Interesting. Missionary. Okay. Well, yeah, yeah, you're a very confident, not shy guy. You know what I mean? No, so. I like to look, and I think it's sexy, and it'll yeah, spit in yeah, the mouth yeah. and all that stuff. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's all good. Damn, okay. Uh, should we... Is that? Do you have any more questions? I don't I don't know. I don't think so. Yeah? Uh, should we ask him to... Group sex? One? You did. Okay. Yes, you did do group sex. Ever been caught? Masturbating or having sex, walked yeah. in on. Oh, for sure. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. A lot of times, you sounded like um, that was a lot. Yeah, I mean, I've had my my uh, my mom got pretty used to the the knock, but like, I've, oh, I've I got... mean, your mom lived in a house where she would encourage you to hey, <laughs> yeah, yeah, she gave you a little fucking, fucking dance off. for it and yeah, stuff. Yeah. So um, she was like, I know, I, she never knows what's going on behind that closed door. No, yeah, yeah. and she, I, I remember one fucking time. Fucking a blanket, a horse. <laughs> no, one, it could be anything. <laughs> in one of the letters that she wrote me in one of the rehabs I went to, uh, she commented on the way that her house stopped feeling like her home in the last few years. And she goes, and having to, like, make dinner and listen to you have sex, Spencer, it was disgusting. Whoa. And I remember her, and like, and she wasn't just saying that one time. She's like, over the years, yeah, like feeling trapped in my own home where I listen to my son just doing drugs, oh, having sex yeah, right above yeah, me, as I'm, yeah. you know. And I was oh, like, yeah. oh, I didn't know you could hear that, <laughs> you know. God Truly, damn, I never can say. I was like, oh, she, she would have said just something. Pantera headboard slam, the yeah, loudest no, no, sex know, anyone's yeah, ever had. Like, banging, yeah. God damn. Um, is that it? Should we ask him the I last one? Grossest thing ever come on your own face, lose your virginity with a condom. All right. I have a ball, right? I have balls like all of us, uh-huh. right? One of them looks different. One of them only tells the truth. <laughs> the other one only one tells of, a lie. Which yeah. ball do you suck? You're not that far off. <laughs> you can <laughs> ask it a question, shake it up. It'll answer, <laughs> yeah. it, it'll answer yes or no. Maybe try again. But uh, it's big. It's big. It's lumpy. It looks fucked up. I feel like me explaining it is bad. Joe will do a better job of that. Just see How, it. Did you hear that? That was great. We yeah. offer to show people. Like, yeah. If you want to see Tim's ball, it's pretty funny. But you yeah, don't have course. to. Okay, no, cool. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Can I hit your yeah. vape while you Absolutely show me your do. ball? Hell yeah. Can I hit your vape while I well, see your ball? I feel like ball? we're getting, getting yeah. intimate. Let's fair get is intimate. fair, you know? Uh, so you. wait, wait. Yeah, get, get camera off him, just his uh-huh. reaction, basically. Okay. And Drop the uh, Hold on. No dick. First, first right away, I mean... What an out! Oh, oh, okay. I thought those were full sweats, but you're. This is such a skinny guy thing to do. You're wearing track pants okay. over a pair of gym shorts. Okay. Well, let, I'll tell you now. I don't own a pair of underwear. Oh, it's true. Because of the balls. Oh, because of what I'm about to see. Yeah. Now I'm feeling them right now. They're particularly tighter to my body than normal. I'll show you a picture after of a good, after a good hard day of work. You know, I had a, I had a day off and a shower today, so yeah. they're looking ready. Okay. But. Oh, Bam. oh my God! <laughs> What's that look like? Oh, dude! I mean, it looks like a sweet potato. It's <laughs> crazy. No, right? oh my God, dude! No, because here's the normal one. Yeah, that's regular. Okay. Right? And yeah. I'm kind of hairless. These aren't. Yeah. These, yeah. So, can you can you move your hand? Move your move your right hand, but keep the shaft up. Like like let them let them kind of dangle in there now. It's crazy, <laughs> my right? God, dude! Mm-hmm. It's yeah. a sock. Doesn't you it know, look like? Go ahead, yeah. Akita. No, what? 
Okay, uh, graphic that? novel. You know what it looks like is you know those. <laughs> <Graphic> <laughs> <novel>? <laughs> you know those uh, I, I keep trying to hit you with Japanese shit. And I realize you yeah. just ate them. Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. it, you know what it looks like is the ad for the mobile game where you're having to just shoot a bunch of zombies and then finally there's like a big, big ball boss? of zombies yeah. rolling oh, toward you. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Mucus, mucus, kind of. Yeah, oh, it does. Yeah, it does. I was gonna say it looks like that chicken nugget you find where you're like score. It's like two. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Together. You totally. Know? You could yeah, post that on like mildly and. Interesting on Reddit, yeah, and it, it yeah. looks like it looks like uh, uh, like a baby brother that grew out of your shoulder. <laughs> yeah, like, you know? yeah, it no, should be a twin. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I was Siamese twins, and the other one didn't get enough nutrition, and, <laughs> and just, that's just, it's just living in your nut. Yeah. That's its face trying to stick yeah, yeah. out of the scrotum like Freddy Krueger. It realized like if I want to be part of this world, this is my only shot. I have uh -huh. to be this guy's balls. See now, if I would, you have a girlfriend. See, and I'm, if I was your girlfriend, see, I'd be out. Mm. That's funky. I'll send you a picture. You show it to your girlfriend, and she'll be my girlfriend in a week. All right? <laughs> we find that that's what women really want. Yeah, it's, just a, it's No, because I... A cancerous ball. It's just a giant ball. No, it's a varicose vein. I've had I've been to doctors. It's a varicose vein. Uh, like, so it's just like, a wad of veins? Yeah, like, you know worse, how, like, an old lady's hand worse. might have, like, a bulge that's lumpy? It's that. Yeah, but that's like a a, a it, wad of them, like a it's a have, giant one. I have the same thing his on my leg. leg I literally exactly have his like ball balls. on my leg. I swear to God. Really? Mm -hmm. Is this yeah. how you guys became friends? Yeah, at a support group. Yeah, well, we just <laughs> we just felt this energy between us. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know what it was, but yeah, well, it's they're, they're calling each other. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I think we got a name for the podcast. What is it? Varicose. Varicose Bros. Yeah. Varicose Bros. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. There you go. Vera Bros. Vera Bros. All right. Yeah. Something like that. Okay. Well, that was that was it. That's crazy. Yeah. Thank you, Spencer. Yeah, appreciate yeah, it. Thanks for uh, asking. Anything, so anything yeah. you have a podcast? Anything you no. want to talk about? All right, cool. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Instagrams will be in the description, everybody. If you've listened this far, we appreciate it, all 12 of you. Thank you so much for tuning in, staying in this long. Send me or Joe an Instagram message. Uh, ask us a question about sex. Tell us a sex story. We'll finally get to it if, if you guys start messaging me. Uh, but thank you so much for listening to uh, the episode and have a great day. Goodbye. Every episode title should just be Watch Till the End. <laughs> You'll yeah, not, you won't believe this. <clears throat> we should open up with the ball. Yeah, that is. Uh, yeah, no.